Hey guys, what's up? What's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Keegan's Kitchen. And for today's recipe, I'll be showing you how to make this delicious Kalalu and Salfish Fritas recipe. Stay tuned. Here are my ingredients that I'll be using for today's recipe. So I have some all-purpose flour, about two cups. I have some water, green onion, salt fish, kalaloo, habanero pepper, some bacon powder. I have my saison seasoning, one tomato, one onion. Um, my salt fish is already cooked, you know, washed and all that good stuff. My uh, kalaloo is already steamed. So we're gonna combine all these ingredients together to create our kalalu salfish fritas. So we're gonna start off by adding our all-purpose flour. That's about two cups. One small tomato dice. This is half onion dice. Habanero pepper. Green onion or scallion. Kalalu. This is already steamed. My salt fish is already, you know, cooked and boiled just to remove all that extra saltiness from it. Add that. Baking powder. Says on seasoning. I'm not gonna add any salt to it because, you know, the salt fish is already salty and the kalaloo have a little bit of saltiness to it already. All right. So you want to combine all these ingredients together, mix it up a little bit. Then we're going to add some water. Don't be afraid. Just add a little bit at a time. Mix it up. This is going to be so good. And the reason why I steam the kalalu before, you know, before I add it to the mixture is because like if you just add the um, kalalu directly to the batter and fry it, it's gonna have a little bit of chewiness to it. So I wanted to make sure it was nice and soft, you know, after the product is finished. All right, so this is the perfect, you know, texture consistency that I'm looking for. So now I'm just gonna add this to my oil. All right, so go ahead and add your butter to the nice hot oil. This is about two tablespoons, you know. Just drop it in nice and slow. And I'm telling you guys, it's gonna be delicious. This is my first time making this recipe. I've made um, saltfish fritas before so I already you know know that this is gonna come out good you know and you don't want to overload the pot you know with your fritas and all them something like just give it a few minutes and let it you know do the work fry for about five minutes you know until them nice and crispy on the outside soft on the inside you know fry fry dumpling already so it's pretty much the same same procedure you know Alright, so go ahead and flip your fritters. So after about two minutes you want to flip it. And I'm frying my fritters on medium high heat right now. how beautiful they are right now so beautiful listen nice and crispy on the outside already and the inside is gonna be nice and moist you know juicy packed with a bunch of flavor the salt fish the kalaloo you know the onion you know all all these amazing ingredients so let's continue to watch the video and see, wait for the finished product all right so our salt fish 
and Callaloo fritters, the first batch, you know them ready. So you just want to remove that from the oil. Give it a nice little shake, you know, just to shake off that extra oil. Mmm, smelling good. Well, now we're gonna add our extra butter that we have left. Yes, 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 our Kalaloo and Saltfish Fritters is good to go. Um, it's golden brown on the outside, nice and crispy, nice and moist on the inside. You know, all these natural ingredients, you know, are infused, you know, into the dough of the fritters and everything. Time for your taste test. All right, guys, time for that nice taste test. Here we go. Take a bite. All right guys, so just wanna say thank you for watching my video and don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I post a new video.